It was the first reverse fixture of WPL 2024 and the last match at the Chinna Swami Stadium, Bangalore. And boy, what a perfect send off was it from RCB and Smriti Mandana to their fans. Welcome to Safed Presents The Outside View, where I review the UP Warriors vs RCB clash. फैमिली के लिए क्या जरूरी है ये है मेरी चॉइस मेरे हर फैसले पे है मेरा मान मेरी प्राइड जैसे मेरा सफेद तुरंत खुले भरपूर झाग दे और इसके स्मार्ट साइंस दे स्मार्ट केयर और फ्रेशनेस मेरी चॉइस मेरा सफेद लाइक इट हैज बीन इन एवरी अदर गेम दिस सीजन व्हेन द टॉस ऑफ टू बोल अलीसा हेली डिड द सेम आरसीबी वेयर आउट टू बैट विद अ न्यू ओपनिंग पेयर Smriti Mandana was out there with S Meghana and they were off to a blazing start as RCB hit 57 in the power play even though they lost Meghana in it RCB were unfazed Mandana and Perry hit 100 in just 12 overs after a dropped catch and a missed pumping Smriti Mandana was surely going to make the Warriors pay and she did with a half century of just 34 balls and that was just the start as she switched one gear up after that 50 hitting seven boundaries in two overs before she holed out at deep mid wicket and that was the end of mandana and perry's 95 run stand and even after smriti mandana's dismissal the flow of runs then stop for rcb as alice perry took the honors on herself she smashed boundaries she smashed sixes she smashed a rapid 50 and finally she smashed the cars window of the sponsors kept in the stadium and with some help from richa ghosh's cameo rcb put up their highest ever total on the board And for UP Warriors, their mammoth chase wasn't off to an ideal start as Reno Kasnik Thakur started off with a maiden no over, but Alisa Haley and Kiran Nabgire made up for it in the coming two overs, hitting 40 of them. But Nabgire soon departed, and Alisa Haley had no support from the other end as the wickets kept falling. Jamari Yatta Party was sent off after a controversial error call on her LBW. Shweta Sarawat was caught up for cheap, and Richa Ghosh pulled off a stunning catch of Grace Harris, and then. pull up a stunning stumping of Alisa Haley ending her brilliant knock of 55 and later on Deepthi Sharma and Poonam Khemna did try hitting fours and sixes here and there but the runs were just too many and at the end UP Warriors fell short by 23 runs player of the match powered by Safed it's pretty obvious isn't it Smriti Mandana is undoubtedly my POTM 80 of just 50 balls 10 boundaries 3 sixes and that too all over the park with some outrageously beautiful shots smriti mandana gave chinna swami the perfect goodbye present so that's it from this episode of safed presents the outside view stay tuned with women's quick zone as we'll bring you all the action from the second leg of wpl 2024 straight from delhi <laughs>